Welcome back to Hyperlight Drifter, and um, ju just to be more precise, it's not the idle animation that's the problem. The problem is that when you get out of it, there's a long pause to get out of it. Like, idle animations are fine, and they're great too. Like, you want to have something happening even if the player isn't pressing any buttons. That's interesting. But, you know, why make the player wait for a second before um, being able to continue moving. Like, that, that makes no sense. There is no reason. Especially not in a game like this, which is all about precision. If it were missed, well, I would probably I would complain a little bit, but I wouldn't think it's as bad, because miss is not about precision. Shouldn't be destroying these things. I might need them later. Where? I don't have. Oh crap! I forgot to. Uh... I keep forgetting to. Oh no! Oh well. The... Okay. And I don't have any healing. Yeah, I might have to go back to the hub world because I keep I the game is kind of not telling me to go heal. Uh, not not heal. It it's not telling me to um to uh go level up. So I tend to forget that I can level up. Which, you know, I think that mm, there must be a better way to do that one as well. Like maybe put an on-screen indication or something. So, I don't know if this is an attack. I don't know what this is. Oh crap, can I not? Oh, I can't even upgrade, I need three. Really? I need three? Yeah, I can see this being useful. Okay, I... <laughs> okay. Um... I don't know why, but I need to get four things to get one bigger thing, but one bigger thing doesn't do anything you need three unless these are unless these shops okay well these ones are two and I guess I get a bomb but I think I would rather have the uh, the deflect thing yeah I'm This game has a lot of cool things, but it also has a lot of very odd, out of place things. Bushes are fun to, to destroy. I just went by and tried to, to um, destroy this bush. Instead, when I try, he does this animation. So, I went from trying to destroy a bush to be having my character paused and not being able to move for a second. I went from going from something that is super satisfying into something that is completely unsatisfying. Um, 
Weird choices. Weird choices for sure. I was hoping that I could uh, replenish my supplies here. Oh, maybe I can here? No, this is a map. So now I have no health packs, and I don't think I have a way of getting health packs. I guess you're wondering why I'm pausing so much, it's because I was trying to, I was looking for less. I don't know why you can't regain your health packs. But, okay, well... I guess if, if these enemies respawn, then every enemy must have respawned. Uh, e every object. There we go. So, I mean, I could go out and refarm every uh, health pack, but what? Like that? That is that is literally padding. That is literally. Oh, you don't have any health pack? Well. Sucks to be you. Spend waste your time finding more health packs. Like no, why? Like that is not fun. Why would you design your game that way? I'll tell you why. Because um, games aren't always designed to be fun. Like it's not rewarding. It's not. There's no. No one is going out there and and going. Oh well, I have to find all my things. Gr great. I'm. So happy about that! Like, mm, I don't get it. Oh no! So... Oh, hmm. well, that's fine. Um, I got confused because I thought they were targeting downwards because the icon was aiming downwards, and uh, that wasn't the case. Did that track? How dare it track? And wall often blend together. Like if I go here, I don't see this as being a path intuitively. I get that it's different from this, but it's kind of all textured the same and it's all very flat, so it's nice pixel art, but sometimes it blends together a little. I'm not sure what could have been done to uh to alleviate that. It got tough! The game got tough!
There's not a lot of enemy variety. Uh, I'm not complaining about that. It's stuff that I'm I'm noticing, like how many enemies are enough. Okay, so... Clearly, there's no reason to leave these behind. I kind of wish that, mm, I was gonna say, uh, when you enter a new section, maybe it would heal you or something. That's a lot of dots. Other stuff that I can notice, uh, health is um, heart based. I had a conversation with someone uh, not too long ago about which is better, quote unquote, heart or um, health based, number based. Mm. It's definitely a different feel to lose one of three than to lose, you know, a portion of the bar. Or rather, it's different to to gain uh, how many how much health you gain. I like that the enemies can kill each other with their spells. This is not an easy boss! Ah, come on! Come on!
No! I tried to heal. I tried to heal. That is a tough boss. I like the music continues. The the music doesn't reset. Well, it, it, it kind of starts to fade off, but if you dive right into it, uh, it'll continue where it, where it was. Do not like this character movement at all. <laughs> it's so stiff. And um, I wasn't noticing it as much early on, but I'm really noticing how stiff it is now. I don't have time to look at the uh, the health bar. Okay, so you can attack three times and then dash away. It is, like it's not unfair, but it is it's not fun because the controls are stiff I don't like the stiff control like there's so much pause it takes so long before you can reuse your abilities and It's not fun. It's not fun. And you know, I I tend to use the expression. It's not fun um, a Lot I, I think what I actually mean is it's not responsive. This is not a irresponsive game it is the same criticism as um, Dark Souls. Dark Souls is not a responsive game at all. Why was I hit there? I wasn't in the field! Like, mm. Oh, come on! Now I'm getting very angry because when when I feel like I'm doing something and the game is not doing what I'm telling it to do, I do I become very irate and yeah I'm fuck 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 no point there's no point there's no point I mmm mm, I'm not liking this at all like this I feel like bosses like these kind of tell me a lot about what I'm going to think about this game and uh, yeah I uh, do not. That was very genuine. <sighs> like I was liking it fine, and a lot of games do that. Like I, Dark Souls didn't, but a lot of games I kind of like them fine for a while, and then they start ramping it up, and it, like the controls don't feel like they were made for the ramp up. They don't.
I need to heal here because if I don't, this deals two damage. Ah, ah, right. I I I'm gonna be honest. This is definitely the the last I'm playing a, a, of. Uh, I mean, I knew I knew when I went into it, right? I, I played on standard and I should have played on easy. I I knew it, and it's it's my fault. It's my fault, and I'm gonna guess that this game does not allow changing difficulty midway, which they should. Uh, but I, I'll bet they don't. But they don't. I could throw my controller at the wall right now. Is there a change for difficulty? There is not. Fuck this. Fuck this. It is so not fun to fight this guy! It is so not fun! Why? Why? I'm not in the field! Collide within your fucking square! What is wrong with you? Like, it's not... Ah! Oh. Everything is so much bigger than it's... You know what the, the actual problem is? The problem is that when you teleport, you're not invincible. In every other way, game, Including Dark Souls, I believe. You're invincible. Not in this game. And it... It's... Why? Why? It's not fun. It sucks. And it, like... And your your area is... Kind of wide, really. You, you expect... Like, I expect that... Okay, I'm not gonna get touched. Yes, I do. Because there's, like, this... Pixel, and it might not like. I think the character's hitbox in some cases is a little bit wider than the ground, which for ground attacks like these really, really suck. Oh, come on. Well, sometimes, like, collision is wonky. Collision needs to be more precise than this. This is an unacceptable level of precision. I hate the fact that I'm getting hit once and I have to heal because this deals two damage and I only have two health, uh, five health. Ugh. I kept wanting to control the dead cells guy in this game. Yeah, absolutely. Yes. That is absolutely true. The 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 um, the dead cells guy is so much more fun to control. And um like this game doesn't like this doesn't feel like it was made for these controls and or for the speed. Which is a massive problem!
Did you beat this boss, by the way? Oh, come on! No! Oh! So the problem is that all game I've been taught to use dodge but now dodge kills me because if you dodge, you dodge directly into the two space thing. Which frankly is fine. It's just frustrating because I, it, it's the, the accumulated frustration of everything else. I don't like this gun. This gun needs tracking. I don't know why it doesn't have any tracking on it. What is that? Okay. That was needlessly difficult. And again, I put it on standard. Um, maybe it was on, on me to put it on easy. But I can't put it on easy now, because the game doesn't allow me to. It is! I'm not satisfied. I don't get satisfied with challenges like these. If I want a tough challenge, there's a world out there of meaningful things I can do with my life, which I do. I'm challenged every day. I try to build a business. I try to make games. I try to market games. Those are tough challenges with a real, tangible, valuable result. I, this is a game. It doesn't matter. Why would, would it matter? Why would I be satisfied with this? Like, no, I, I don't. I, that's not why I play games. I play games for entertainment. Does this use the same ammo? I don't think it does. So when I stop being entertained, well, yes, I do become very irate and very dissatisfied. I would love to see the uh, the design of this game. The uh, how I would like to see the the uh, game design document because there's a lot of 
small things that build to medium things that build to big things. Well, I can just teleport now. I will say this. I did get better. I did get better at beating the boss, and in the end, I did learn how to beat the boss. Like, there, there there's some times that I feel like I've beaten a boss because I was lucky. On that one, I feel like I it was actual learning. But, um... I'm so, like, that's, you know. And I've, like, I've died several times on, um, dead cells. And I, I, I never got this level of frustration. So clearly, dead cells does something that this game doesn't. I can't believe that I completed a, a whole section and it gave me one upgrade. Which, uh, I think the bullets one is better. I don't know. I wasn't attacked by bullets all that much. This. Hopefully I don't regret it. Oh. I just got an upgrade. So the first thing, what, what is the first thing you do when you get an upgrade? Try the upgrade. It's the first thing you want to do. Because I'm in the fucking village, I can't. I can't try the upgrade that I just bought. That is stupid. Like, it's, it, it's obvious. Obviously, the first thing you want to do is try the upgrade. Obviously. Come on. I, I forgot where I'm supposed to go. Uh, I don't know if I should... I mean, I, I'm supposed to cut for for the episode right here. I'll do one more. I'll do one more episode because we're going into a different area, so I want to see the visuals of it. So, one last episode of um, Hyperlight Drifter right after this. After I calm down. Which I'm not, because it's going to be a few seconds after now. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching. You know the drill. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And be sure to check out some games I've made, like Arrow Light Core. Alright, until next time, peace out!